Wow, so Sumino-san didn't come today either. Awesome, I bet you'll never go near Hinata again. Huh? Hinata's not here either. Neither is Teru. Jeez, it's so annoying that we're not in his class. Oh, Aya? Uh... Huh? Uh, I, I have something I want to say to you. Hmm. Oh, yeah? That's right. You were in the middle of apologizing to the class, weren't you? And you came just to finish. Good girl. That's, that's not, that's not why. Come on, you have to finish your speech. Wh where? Why, the obvious place. For your brave apology speech, you have to be in front of the entire class. Otherwise, people won't believe that you really mean it. That girl, will she be okay? Why, please? Everyone in class 2-3, listen up. Zumino san from your class has something very important to tell you all. Huh? What's she gonna say? Maybe it's about the email. Well, Sumino san, go ahead. Uh, uh, what's the matter? I can't hear you. Isn't there something you wanted to tell us? <sighs> Why don't you just come out and say it? Just say it. Hinata-kun is a nice person and I took advantage of him. I did a horrible thing. I'm sorry. That's not what... Huh? I didn't... I didn't come here to apologize. <laughs> Quit fooling yourself! You little brat. Just how low you stooped to take advantage of Hinata. You know that he just feels sorry for you, right? He may be a nice guy, but he'd rather not have anything to do with you. You use your poor little girl act to trick him so he can't say no to you. Get it into your head and he's only hanging out with you out of pity. She should just give up and apologize already. You're right. Why don't you just get it over with? You did annoy Hinata after all. Yeah, why don't you just admit it? Yeah. Cut it out already. Just apologize. apologize. Zumino-san, if you just say it, you'll feel apologize. a lot better. Hmm? I can't hear you. I'm... I'm sorry. We're here. For you. What was that, Sumino-san? Jeez, I guess I have no choice. I'm not... I'm not going... I'm not going to apologize. Why, you? Uh, your face. It's so... Hinata couldn't doesn't hang out with me out of pity. Well then, why does he? He found... He found me and brought me out of the darkness. Uh, what? Nobody... Nobody ever used to notice me. I was always invisible. It didn't matter if I was there or not. I wanted to change, but I didn't believe that I ever could. I thought I'd always be alone and unnoticed. But... But Hinata-kun, Hinata-kun was the only one who ever noticed me. Good morning. He taught me about human warmth. What about you? He made me want to change myself and want to grow. Hinata-kun is someone so, so important to me. She was always alone, wasn't she? Uh, even though we've been in the same class for over a year, I can't believe we made her feel that way. What way? Even though she's a member of our class, too. Sorry, Sumino. Sorry for not realizing... Wait! Wait a second, guys! What? What are you gonna do about this email? It's true that she made Hinata go out with her! Why are you believing everything she says? Why are you so obsessed with that? That email doesn't even make any sense! She's right! Sumito-san, I mean Sumino-san, she could never do that! Maybe it was made up by someone who is in love with Hinata. Just maybe. <laughs> Just forget it, Aya. What are you? Cut it out, Maya! Don't believe what her class means! How could you? I'll... I'll... I'll, I'll never accept this! Hinata!